The Bradford test or Bradford assay is a technique used for protein quantification. It is one among many colorimetric assays used to determine the total protein concentration in a solution. The Bradford method is based on a dye named Comasi Brilliant Blue. In an acidic solution this reagent is protonated and has a reddish or brownish color. In the presence of protein, Comasi Brilliant Blue stably binds to them. The dye protein complex quickly takes a blue color. Required for this reaction is an acidic environment. The complex formation results in a shifted absorption maximum of the dye. The protein solution can be measured in a spectrophotometer at 595 nanometers. In the absence of protein, there is no change in color. The absorption maximum does not shift. How does Comasi Brilliant Blue G250 interact with the proteins? This is Comasi Brilliant Blue in an acidic environment. In the presence of protein, the reagent disrupts the protein structure. That exposes the amino acid side chains. The sulfonic acid groups of the dye interact with the positive amino groups of the protein found in basic amino acid residues present in lysine, arginine and histidine. This results in a stable form of the dye and the color turns blue after dye protein complex formation. But how do we determine the protein concentration? The spectrophotometer measures the optical density at 595 nanometers. First, the pure solution without any protein content is measured. To calculate the protein concentration of an unknown sample, we need a reference solution where the protein concentration is already known. This is classified as the standard. In most cases, the protein BSA is used for this. Different dilutions of this standard are made. The optical density is measured for 1 microgram per microliter and higher concentrations such as 2 and 4 microgram per microliter. That generates a linear curve in which the optical density increases proportionally with protein concentration. Now the sample with the unknown protein content is measured. The spectrophotometer assigns the optical density and with extrapolation we can calculate the protein concentration which will be 3 microgram per microliter. The Bradford test has advantages and disadvantages. One advantage is that the Comasi dye interacts quickly with the proteins. The assay can determine protein concentrations in a very short time. It is also easy to use since it just requires the Bradford reagent and a spectrophotometer. The assay can be performed at room temperature. In comparison to other protein quantification techniques, the Bradford method is extremely sensitive. It can even detect protein concentrations of 1 microgram per milliliter. One of the disadvantages is interference with detergents such as SDS. Since the Comasi dye reacts mainly with the basic amino acids, the assay faces another limitation. It is dependent on the protein's amino acid composition. The Bradford assay is just one among many protein quantification techniques. Make sure to subscribe and take a look at the channel for more scientific videos. Thanks for watching.